All right. It's nice and early Saturday morning. I'm back out at my trusty fallback park. Uh, maybe five inches down. I just got my second target. First one was a pull tab. Second one is in this little clump of dirt. And it appears to be a silver dime. Nope. Not even close to a silver dime. It's a regular dime. And it's red and nasty and it's been in the ground for quite some time. But let's see what comes out. Three inches down. Maybe teeny tiny. But it's gold. See if we can get the camera to focus. Tiny little pen. It says McDonald. And on the back, I've already checked it out. It says 10K on that side. And MW Peters on the bottom. It's a tiny little pen. And it's gold. About four inches down. Let's see appears to be an old coin. Oh, looks like a button. Oh, it is a button. Let's see, let's see what it says. Bobcat. Cub Scouts. Boy Scouts of America. Huh, it's kind of neat. Well, it just goes to show you. You never know what you're going to find. Well, my statement stands true. You never know what the hell you're going to find. How's that? That fucking thing took some work to get out, I'll tell you. I like finding bullets, but finding bullets in the park when they're just the heads and they're big and fat, eh, kind of makes you wonder. I mean, we're in a city park, and eh, it's not like it's in the woods, and I find bullets here all the time. Well, let's see what's next. Oh boy. So, I flip over a plug. See if I see that. And I have a feeling it's going to be another heartbreaker. Because I don't find real diamonds. But holy cow, is that a freaking heart stopper. But yeah, it appears. That it's junk. I'm so sick of finding fake diamonds. <sighs> really? I mean, come on now. Can I just have one real diamond? Oh, that's a freaking old piece of something. Looks like there's a broom in the upper left hand corner there and I'll probably never figure out what the hell this thing is but it's old that's about all I know it's green so it's probably copper and uh yeah let's see what's next oh I was getting a penny signal Four inches down, dug my plug, took out a scoop, and there it is. That's green, green. And I have no clue what it is. Can't make out anything on that damn thing. 
Uh, I'm going to have to clean it up when I get home. See if I can figure out what the hell it is. More weird junk. No idea what this damn thing is. It was, I don't know, seven inches down. Clean it up, see if I can identify it, but not likely. Well, let's see what's next. You want some something weird and unidentifiable found? Call me. I'll find it for you. I don't know what the hell that thing is. I seem to be finding all kinds of stuff that is something, but yet I have no clue what that something might be. Well, looks like I got me another penny. Oh, it's a greeny. And this one, I can identify as a wheat penny. See the wheat, but can't get a date. So, oh yeah, I can. 1956. Hmm. Let's see what's next. What the hell is that thing? That stupid little thing rang up as a half dollar. Yeah. Half dollar, my ass. All right, so there's my hole, and there's the target from said hole. Really? I mean, come on now. This is just getting out of control with the weird shit. I think I'm going to have to start calling my videos Sean's World of Weird Shit. Well, let's see what's next. Well, I decided to come out to the cellar hole. And the park was about done for the day. Well, decided to change it up from the park and come out to my cellar hole that I found over here. And Hidden by the well. This is my first target, actually. Looks like an old oil can. But hopefully, something good will come out of here today. And uh, I think I'm going to hit right around the hole, which is right there. And over here by the well. And try and make my way over that way a little bit. See if we can pull something out of here. So, which and all, if I get anything else. What do you make of that? Faucet handle, maybe? Yeah. That's what it looks like to me. I don't know. It was six inches down or so. Pretty heavy. Feels like brass or copper or something to that nature. Let's see what else we can find. Oh, one thing about these colonial places. You never know what you're going to find. I actually dug up this big ass shovel head with a piece of pottery of some sort. I don't know. I'm going to keep looking in this hole and see if there's anything else down there. I'll keep you updated. Holy Christ! That's a big ass old square spike. It was, I don't know, eight inches down. Fun digging, I'll tell you. Give me some coins.